Hey guys, how are ya? I want to talk about one ingredient of my nine ingredients of love, which is generosity. So I've had conversations with people about giving money to homeless people. And some people will say, oh, you're just enabling people. You shouldn't give them money. They're just going to buy drugs and alcohol. And I kind of have a different view. I understand their point of view, but I look at it from a different perspective. I look at it from a perspective that one, we don't know what this person is thinking. We have no idea. We're not mind readers. We can't externalize or point fingers. We have no idea what their story is. What if that one contribution, that one gift of $20 that you gave to this homeless person was the one thing that all of a sudden sparked this aha moment, this spiritual awakening that got them to change their whole life around? Isn't that the purpose of generosity? Is basically not making it about a selfish thing, about thinking like, oh, they're just gonna use drugs and alcohol, therefore I'm not gonna give it to them, compared with, wow, I'm giving them $20 and they might change their whole life. And as a result, they're going, it's gonna cause a ripple effect and they're gonna pay it forward. I much like that idea rather than the other idea of not giving the money away. So I want you to think about your life and think about your generosity, what you contribute to the world. Do you want to become a change agent of good and have hope that things will get better? Or do you want to stay stuck in the thinking of, oh, I'm not going to help people because it's just going to make things worse. That's what you really have to look at and it's a good point to ponder so take some time think about that you know think about what generosity means to you and if you want to know more about the nine ingredients of love come to my website www.holisticwellcare.coach uh, book a call with me and uh, i'll share that with you in fact i'll even send one to you <laughs> guys have a great day take care bye